But one final stock that we are keeping an eye on is shares of AT&T. Now, we are seeing these shares up about 4%, a little under 4% here in the first couple minutes of trading. And today is the first day that we had the Warner Bros. Discovery. That merger has now been completed. AT&T has now spun off that media division. Uh, we'll see what this ultimately means here for the streaming wars for some of the incumbents like a Netflix, like a Disney Plus. But at least for now, investors do seem to be optimistic about this slimmed down AT&T now focusing more on that telecommunications side of the business. Uh, but Brian, again, we'll see if the stock pop can continue. Oh, wait a second, Emily. This is me. My eyes are closed. This is me falling asleep about the potential uh, of investing in AT&T. See, my eyes are just closed. I, it, really, I, I understand where JP Morgan is coming uh, from this morning. That's analyst Philip Cusick, who's coming out here and, and bullish on AT&T, noting that they can invest billions of dollars to build out their 5G network, don't have to pour any money into a media outfit. But still, I, here's a sleepy telecom here, Emily, that has been uh, not necessarily focused on, on growing its dividend. Its operations have been under pressure, a lot of competition in the wireless market. So it's going to be hard to, I think, really drum up investor interest longer term in AT&T, especially uh, as it builds out and invests a lot in developing that 5G network.